when when I stabbed him t the, f the first one twice, I threw the knife on the bed. Until a few days ago, 21-year-old Chidima Adora Ojuku was not known to the public. However, her desire to have an enjoyable and quiet time with her newfound lover, the chief executive officer of an organization, turned sir. And today, Chidima is right inside the nets of the Nigerian police, answering questions to why she had to stab to death her lover. I was on drugs and also um, during the struggle that he was trying to strangle me, that was when I used the knife on him. Chidima says she has been into drugs since she was 19 years, unknown to anybody, including her parents. It was a party where drugs was given. That was when I took drugs at the first time. Chidima informed me that she met the deceased just a few weeks ago in Lagos. And until their first quiet time together in a hotel, she never knew the deceased would meet her financial needs. So she decided to do things her own way. At that time he was sleeping. I tried his hand so that by the time he wakes up, he will be able to um, give me what I want and I will go. I don't understand. You signed a man's hand. Yes. How? How are you able to do that? It was already high, so he didn't feel it. And it took more than I did. After listening attentively to Chidima's confession, respondents are wondering if it wasn't a premeditated crime. No, I didn't. Because you know he said he signed his hands. Yeah. For him not to... Um, when he wakes, for him not to attack me. But you had the mind to steal from him? Yes. Hmm? Yes. So what, what, what would you want to steal from him? After all, you was a boyfriend and two of you were enjoying yourself. So what would you want to have the mind to kill him, to hurt him? Yes, I needed the money. After you had killed him, you still took away his ATM cards to go withdraw money from his account? That's because I needed the money. So when he was gone, I just took everything and left. If you had asked him, please, sir, or my lover, what I called him, I need money from you for this. Do you think he would have been so stingy not to give to you? I asked him, but he said he didn't have. And you knew he had the money? Yes. Chidema says her dream is to be a successful actress and musician. She is presently a 300 level student of mass communication in the University of Lagos. With this, I visited the university. She smoked loud and uh, SK. That's a form of marijuana that he took, that she took and made her to be high. But one thing is certain, if one is high, one can sleep, one can lie down there, but to have resorted to killing means that the girl has a problem. Listen to more. Both of them, the man and the lady, were high. And, uh, you know, if they are saying that you are tired of sex or whatever you are saying you are tired of, you know, but you are in that condition, you are still smoking and still drinking heavily. So it, it, you can see that a girl that can do that is not the first time that she's doing it. With this development, what action is the university authorities taking since Chidima is still a student of the school? That she's a student of Union Lag is not, a, not an issue. When her fate will be decided by the judiciary. Will she be readmitted if pardoned by the law? If the girl has shown this uh, uh, that she can kill, that she, can, she has what it takes to do all these things, I don't think she's fit to uh, be among uh, other peers like that because she can do more dangerous things, like I said. I took a trip to Chidima's home at Alagomeji area of Yaba in Lagos. The gates of the premises were under lock and key. Maybe out of fear of the unknown, no single person in the vicinity agreed to say anything to me about Chidima or the crime she committed. Back to Chidima, all through my interaction with her, Chidima was in tears and blames her action on the absence of her mother in the home. I make um, decisions that sometimes I need someone to talk to, but 
I just don't see it. I just do it. Shola Aleton disagrees with her. It's not about a mother or father. What will happen will happen, even if the parents are together. We have seen cases where parents are together and the children are, they became reward. As it is now, respondents say there is more to the story than already heard. Newsline will update you as events unfold. <laughs>